welcome here to Creativity Corner TV. We're your hosts, Don Manuel. And Deborah. And we're here live with our first Cooking with the Snoop Dogg Cookbook. So this was ranked number one. one. on Amazon. It's Amazon's number one cookbook. Um, it's called From Crook to Cook by Snoop Dogg. Platinum recipes from the Boss Dog's Kitchen. Oh yeah. And since we're huge fans of Uncle Snoop around here at Creativity Corner, we had to do Creativity Corner Cooks with Snoop's book. Right. So we took turns picking recipes we wanted to try. Don Manuel's recipe is up first, and that is Billionaire's Bacon. Mm -hmm. So we're going to make some Billionaire's Bacon. Yeah, with we you are. Live now. Um, are you going to share that out? Do some, yeah, some of your mojo? Yeah, I'm going to share this out real quick to some of our friends. Apparently we could do that here, too. I don't know. It's too... Oh, no, never mind. I didn't know what that did. Anywho, okay. we're going to figure this out. Wow, okay. So I'm just going to uh, quickly just uh, read to you. This Billionaire's Bacon is, this is for when you on some real playa shit and ain't got time for that regular swine. Um, I've heard this called Millionaire's Bacon, some black pepper for that smoke, a little fire from some red pepper flakes, and a heap of brown sugar like D'Angelo. And you've just fried up a pile of Uncle Snoopy's Billionaire Bacon. Like my guy, Justin Timberlake, as my other homie, Sean Parker, said in that Zuckerberg flick, The Social Network, a million dollars isn't cool. You know what's cool? A billion dollars. Now eat up and go get that. So we are going to make some Billionaire's Bacon. So the first thing you want to do is preheat your oven to 400 degrees. And we've already done that. And you want to prep your pan. So we have a cooking, you know, a baking sheet, a cooking sheet covered in aluminum foil. And then um, a, you know, little thing on there to put your bacon on. So aluminum foil, wire rack on top of the foil, and you're prepped and ready to go. Okay, and then we are going to, in our little bowl here, we are gonna put uh, half a cup of brown sugar, one teaspoon of cracked back black pepper, and one teaspoon of red pepper flakes. So it's gonna be a little spicy, right? I like my new shirt, love thyself. It's part of the goddess collection at downmobilepresents.shop. Um, I love this shirt, love thyself. I just got it, I'm very, very excited to have gotten it. So, first off, Half a cup of brown sugar. You cannot go wrong with brown sugar. I'm gonna pop that in our little bowl. And because it's cracked black pepper, I'm not actually gonna measure a teaspoonful. I'm just gonna crack it in there until it looks like a teaspoon to me, right? So, some cracked black pepper. Because cracked black pepper is nice and chunky, so you really get that pepper taste. And then a teaspoon a red pepper flakes. Now, I'm going to tell you, I'm only doing this for Uncle Snoop because I don't actually like uh, red pepper flakes. But it might add some interesting heat to the sweetness as it cooks. And then we're just going to stir that up. So we have a nice brown sugar, black pepper, red pepper flakes mixture. Oh, I hear myself in the background. So that's it. That's all you do. Stir up your brown sugar, your one teaspoon of cracked black pepper, and one teaspoon of red pepper flakes. And then you want some thick cut bacon, right? Nice and thick because you want it in there in the oven long enough for the brown sugar to caramelize. That's what I think. So um, you want thicker bacon so it doesn't, you know, charcoal while you're waiting for your brown sugar to caramelize. So... Snoop's recipe calls for eight slices of thick cut light bacon, and we're just gonna pop that on our sheet. We need some entertainment, sir, while I'm baconing. What's going on in Creativity Inter Corner land? Entertaining, wow. entertaining, <laughs> entertaining. <laughs> hey guys, sorry about that. We're, we're, uh, obviously we're not in our normal set, we so we're using a different setup and this is our first time running it and it's actually a little bit more difficult doing it this and way. And Mercury's in retrograde, so <laughs> it just wants to F with us, man. Right. It just F with us. I can tell you a story about what I did today if you would like to laugh at the idiotness oh. that can be me. So, today, 
I wanted to measure how much snow we got. If you live in the Northeast, we just got hit by quite the nor'easter. Okay, if you were the bacon toucher, the next thing you're gonna do is wash your hands. Yeah, right? That's 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 not in the recipe. That's just a little tip. Just a little tip from Creativity Corner. If you're the bacon toucher, you wash your hands with soap and water. Okay? So a little soap and water, wash your hands after touching the bacon. Um, so today I wanted to measure the snow. So I had a yardstick, right? And I was trying to get my coat on and my mittens and zip my coat and the yardstick kept falling down. I couldn't pick it up with my mittens. So I put the end of my, the yardstick in my mouth to hold it so it wouldn't tip over. So I got the yardstick in my mouth and zipped my coat. I got my gloves on and then I go to lean over to pull my boots on with the yardstick still in my mouth. Bam. So I go forward, the yardstick hits the ground, the yardstick goes up, tries to poke a hole through my brain. Mercury's in retrograde, y'all. I tried to, I, I tried to, yeah, death by yardstick today. All right, what do we do next? We take our lovely half cup brown sugar, one teaspoon red pepper flakes, one teaspoon cracked black, black pepper, and we are going to put it all over our bacon, right? There we are. So I um, just sprinkle it along. Now just know that when this is baking, because some of this is dribbling down onto your baking sheet, that's gonna burn. <laughs> It's sugar, it's gonna burn, it's gonna make a mess, but your bacon's gonna be perfect. Your, your bacon's not gonna burn. I know this because we made a batch right before this, so we can try this with you. Right. I'm also hoping the red pepper flakes in the batch that we're gonna try um, doesn't hurt my boo-boo that is in the roof of my mouth from trying to eat the yardstick today. We'll see how that goes. All right, y'all, that's it. This goes in the oven. Let's take a nice, nice peek at our bacon. Check that out, right? Oh, so that's eight slices of thick cut bacon covered in our brown sugar, black cracked pepper, and red pepper flakes mixture. It's gonna go in the oven at 400 degrees. Thank you, sir. For about 30 minutes. And you're gonna wanna rotate that at about 15 minutes because ovens just don't cook evenly. It's facts, right? So that's it, 30 minutes later, you are gonna have billionaire's bacon. Mm. Now we are gonna try some with you because we made a batch um, in advance. We haven't tried it yet, so we're gonna try it live here with you. Um, Mr. Manuel here likes his extra crispy. So I cooked it a little extra. This batch is gonna be cooked a little less, um, more to my liking. And we're probably going to pair it up with some eggs after this. Why does it look um, like it says okay? It does say okay. <laughs> it's going to be okay. Even it's though you tried to okay. eat a yardstick today, right? Oh, You're everything's going to okay. be okay. So, Billionaire's Bacon from, from Crook to Cook, Snoop Dogg's Cookbook. Um, This is Creativity Corner Cooks with Snoop's Book. And our first recipe. You ready? Oh, yeah. Okay. Get in there. Alrighty, I want this one. There you okay. go. So it's nice. It looks it's a little perfect. Look at that. It is caramelized deliciousness. Mm. You ready, my love? Oh, yes. Okay. That's like candy bacon right there. Mm -hmm. Oh, my gosh. Mm hmm. Yo. Snoop. Mm -hmm. Snoop with the hookup. Mm hmm. Yo. All right, y'all need this oh. recipe. <laughs> y'all need to do your bacon like this every time. Oh. If not, you're not you're not doing yourself justice. And the red pepper is not nope. crazy. Nope. It really does balance the heat. Yo. Mm. This is life right now. I am not mad at that. Wow, y'all. Mm -hmm. Okay. Hey, if you want to try some, we're going to have a whole bunch of it. We're about to have eight more slices. So. Okay. Um, wow, that's delicious. Mm -hmm. So I think we're going to fry up some eggs. Oh, yeah. And some toast with our bacon. Yeah, you do. Billionaire's bacon. Wow. So next week, I got to choose the recipe. Yes, you did. And we are going to make, be making fried bologna sandwiches. And I am so excited about making some fried bologna sandwiches. Uh, one of us is, in, is excited. We're going for billionaire bacon. <laughs> Billionaire bacon to fry bologna sandwiches. sandwiches. This was like up in Creativity Corner's house. 
Yeah. Um, we're in a nice juxtaposition. What um, else we got? We got the my my sweet potato pie coming up. That's my choice as well. We got some yardy yard bird. His choice. Mac and cheese. My choice. And then we got some down under lobster thermidor. He really wants to try to make lobster live on Facebook. We're gonna do it. We're gonna be making We're lobster. Gonna do it. And then His last but not dessert. least, we got the oh hustle hard chocolate cheesecake. His choice. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Anybody know what a chocolate wafer cookie is? That's what is the crust is chocolate wafer cookie. I was thinking Oreos, but maybe I think I'm wrong. And then I was like, chocolate graham crackers? I don't know. I got to Google it. Or I got to send Snoop a note. Snoop, if you're listening and watching, mm -hmm. what's a chocolate wafer cookie? That's the first question. Right? Second question, are we allowed to use your music in the background? Yeah, dude. Because we know everybody wants to be dancing right now while we're cooking. But right? we don't want to get taken down, so we didn't put the music. So. Right? Especially the... Song. Yeah, she has a bet. We have I a bet have a going bet on. about that song. Yeah. So if you ever want to like tune in, Snoop, and talk to me about that song, I have a theory. Yep. All right, let's wrap this up. All We're right, gonna guys. finish cooking our bacon. Um, we we tried it with you. This is okay. Let's let's give this a rating. Like I'm thinking, this is a ten out of ten. Try this. Yeah. No, dude, y'all need to try this. Like this is a creativity corner recommends you try yeah. this bacon. Yeah. Like our, our, our friends around the corner, y'all should come try a piece. Like, this is delicious. Make like, sure you Snoop Dogg pregame before you come, though. Mm hmm. Okay. Scoop! Thanks for tuning in, guys. Hope to see you guys next week for fried bologna sandwiches. Yeah! <laughs> this is Creativity Corner approved. Definitely. Creativity Corner is going to keep cooking with Snoop's book. Yeah, we are. So make sure to tune in. Stay safe out there, guys. Make sure to wear your mask, social distancing. Stay warm. Stay warm. Spread love, guys. And do something creative. Share something creative that you've done. Yeah. Or want to do. So, remember, together we'll do better. Why? For we are one. Yeah, we are. We'll see you guys later. Aw, Snoop, man. Billionaire bacon. <laughs>